Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel and to Crone's Warrior Wrestling. So then we've arrived at the pay-per-view resection, which is named after a life-saving operation I had around 10 years ago. And I actually could be having around the time when this video comes out. But enough of the event explanation, here we are in Newcastle, England. All the current titles are going to be on the line tonight, and we are going to be crowning a new quick draw champion. But coming up first, we've got the tag team titles, as the NWO get their rematch against D-Generation X. Kevin Nash able to pick up that win over Bray Wyatt. We still don't know what Biggie's story was in that match, but he did take a knee. And here are the Crohn's Warrior Tag Team Champions, Shawn Michaels and Triple H, D-Generation X. This is just going to be a one-on-one -on -one normal match. So no dirty tactics from either team, this will be a fair win whoever wins it. Triple H and Shawn Michaels appear to be doing some role reversal. Not sure that now's the time to be changing it up before an important match. Scott Hall and Kevin Nash then looking ready to take back what was theirs. I'm not really sure what the look is there from DX. Not really looking like they're on the same page. But here we go then, it's Kevin Nash and Triple H to start it off. So then who's going to leave resection with the Crohn's Tag Team Championships? Oh my god, I think Kevin Nash may have just been not clean out. The referee not really interested on checking on him and Triple H helps him up. And clearly he is okay as he starts fighting back in a massive shoulder tackle from Kevin Nash. Triple H straight to his feet but whipped into the corner. Luckily Scott Hall there just able to get out of the way in time. And the crowd going absolutely mental at the minute. Sure they're chanting subscribe now, subscribe now. But maybe not. There's Triple H now fighting back. It's the best of Kevin Nash into a back body drop. Maybe looking to set Nash up. Drags him into the corner of DX. And a tag to Michaels. And D Generation X able to get the fresh man in. A massive shot to Michaels and his groggy. And Kevin Nash, such a big man, not able to be knocked down, but Shawn Michaels can't even pick him up either. And a massive big boot. And Triple H does not look best pleased at Michaels' performance so far. It's Kevin Nash just taunting the crowd. But Michaels does manage to fight back with a face buster. But the elbow again not strong enough to take Nash off his feet. Whips him back into the corner. Maybe getting Triple H back in this match might be a good idea. But he's not going to get chances. Nash levels Triple H to the outside. And Michaels then left alone at the minute. Goes for an early pin but surely not enough. And it isn't. Barely a one count. Michaels so far then surviving as Triple H does come back to the apron and Kevin Nash now might be wise to try and get a tag in if he can. But I think he might be looking to set up a jackknife powerbomb instead. Michaels needs to reverse and he does into a face buster. And maybe again there he should have gone for the tag and Kevin Nash does manage to get a tag and Scott Hall straight in the fresh man. But Michael's able to get the better of him so far. 
And Triple H is going absolutely mental for the tag on the apron. Shawn Michaels looking to do everything himself, but he does somehow manage to pop back up straight away there. Will that big DDT keep him down? And still Triple H looking for the tag as Scott Hall chokes on Shawn Michaels. And I think we're about to see the choke slam. And is that it for Michaels? Scott Hall picks him up again and again Shawn Michaels fighting back. And the spinning elbow does take Scott Hall down but why is he not going for the tag? Why is Shawn Michaels so reluctant to do all this all himself? He does seem to be getting the job done so far. But he has taken some rather big hits including that one. And again he's not able to get a tag. And a big right hand from Scott Hall into the back body drop and nearly all the way out of the ring. I think Shawn Michaels got really lucky then, it could have been the end of his night. And now it's Scott Hall taunting the crowd. There's a worn Shawn Michaels just laying dead in the ring. And Triple H just watching on now, he has given up on going for a tag. Will he go for something here? And again Michaels reversed and thrown into now the NWO's corner. And a big clothesline. And Scott Hall now setting up for another deadly powerbomb. And I don't think Michaels is going to reverse this time. And down he goes. Will he stay down for the pin? Triple H heading in to break it up. Can he get there in time? And he does. DX and a one count away then from losing the tag team championships and Scott Hall's gonna regret going after Triple H there he goes after him again and knocks him off the apron and again setting Michaels up for something is he gonna go for another razor's edge Michaels reverses sweet chin music and falls on top of Scott Hall will that be it and Scott Hall just kicks out and let's see that again there. Michaels with a reversal and then a switch in music. Almost gets the three count. Back to the action then and Shawn Michaels still wearing down Scott Hall. Scott Hall able to fight back and throws Michaels in the corner. Can he get the tag? And a chance then for the NWO to work together. Michaels has been in this match for a long time now. Still not able to or wanting to tag in Triple H. And Michael's taken so many shots to that back. And it looks like Kevin Nash now may be setting up to give him another one. Drags him to the ropes instead. What's Nash thinking of here? Just choking Michaels on the rope. The referee, is he blind? And Kevin Nash now may be looking for the jackknife powerbomb. And if it hits this it'll be up to Triple H again to save Michael surely as he will not kick out of this. And are the NWO going to win the championships? Triple H walks away. And Triple H has got to feel like that Shawn Michaels tried to do that all by himself. as Michaels repeatedly took shots to the back but never went to tag Triple H in even when he had the chance to and when it all came down to it in the end Triple H refused to save Shawn Michaels but they have lost the tag team championships this was the switch in music to Scott Hall where Shawn Michaels must have thought he'd won it and Scott Hall just kicking out in time. And you can see Shawn Michaels there saying sorry to Triple H as he goes down. But Triple H just not interested. And the NWO then managed to get back the Crohn's Warrior Tag Team Championships. If you've liked the video don't forget to drop a like. If you're not subscribed then please do. 
as there's some great matches still to come. The NWO could actually leave here tonight with most of the belts as Sting will take on Daniel Bryan in the main event. But until then, I'll catch you in the next one.